And tonight, two former Hialeah police officers are out of jail and are now on house arrest. We're also seeing the body camera footage that led to their arrests. Local 10 crime specialist Bridget Matter is live with the new evidence. Bridget. This case is far from finished tonight. Those two former Hialeah police officers were released from jail and are now on house arrest. This police body camera footage is at the center of a kidnapping case involving two former Hialeah police officers. Prosecutors say this guy, Jose Ortega Gutierrez, was beat up by Rafael Otano and Lorenzo Ophelia. He's saying a police officer did this to him and then dropped him off here. The two answered a disturbance call at a Hialeah bakery, taking Gutierrez into custody. But GPS data reveals the squad car driving to an isolated area where the beating allegedly happened while Gutierrez was handcuffed before he was left. A drunken statement of a career criminal. In court, the defense team pointed to a lack of credibility, criminal history, and inconsistent statements. The victim, who is homeless, is known to police. Those former officers are not the only ones charged in this case. A man named Ali Salet is accused of bribing the victim to change his story, and a fourth man is accused of notarizing the paperwork. The four men were given a bond pending trial. We briefly spoke to Orphelia's mother. Standing up for her son, saying he would not be so cruel. Our cameras captured Orphelia ducking into his home as he begins house arrest. We visited the last address for Otano, but a man said he no longer lives there. We did make attempts to talk to Ophelia after we watched him go home, but no one answered the door. We're live in Hialeah, Bridget Matter, Local 10 News.